Hi, I'm Ken Burgess, the QA lead here at Giant Software, and today we have something special planned for you. We want to show you the journey a mod basically takes once you upload it to ModHub. So we're going to be showing you what happens once it lands here, how we test it, and like the different station that it goes through. The first test every mod uh, goes through is of course our data check. Usually when you submit a mod, it either lands in our uh, pending list or our pending resubmit list, depending on if it was here before or not. So this is Marcel. He basically takes care of like the first look of a mod. We have a fancy tool here. Uh, what it does is it goes through a series of tests and um, you, oh, of course errors can always happen. Does it take long from checking mods to finally releasing them? Um, our next station here is um, our gameplay functionality test. Um, so each mod is basically loaded into the game and we check its main functions and make sure the uh, game doesn't crash, of course. We make sure there's no errors or warnings. Of course, we also have, uh, seen right here, our mods and testing list. Um, Jana, is that done? No, not yet. Oh. Okay, um, well then. So what's up with the testing list? Uh, people really want to see it. And why won't they give it to you? I honestly don't know. Another important thing for us is of course our close collaboration and communication that we have with the modding community. That's why we came up with the messenger ticket system. Um, this year Stefan he takes care of all of the messenger tickets that you guys write. So if you ever have like an issue or a problem with your like your upload or your mod, you can... Oh boy, many messenger tickets this morning, Stefan, huh? Well, like every morning. Well, I guess we'll leave you to it then. And of course, the final step is uh, the console testing phase. So once a mod is done and everything is fine and it passed like the functionality test, then we do uh, our tests with our secret dev kits. They're locked behind uh, doors. Um, and of course, we have like a daily pack of mods um, that we prepare for consoles. And once that's ready, our console tester who's in here, he will take care of those. Hello, I have a new USB stick full of console mods for you. So, you like testing mods on console? Yes, I love it! And you're doing a video for BarnCon? Hello? Hello? Once all of this is done, there's two ways. Either a mod is sent back to review to the modder or it's put on pending release. So usually when we're putting it on pending release, that means it's time to release it. Uh, Marcel, don't you think it's time? Uh, how late is it? About five. Nah, it's too soon. Okay. So, when exactly do you release mods each day? People are waiting, right? 